Right, back in the kitchen with the lovely Amy Hopkins who's doing a bit of a uh, bright tongue Can dance. You see what is happy that? Dance on? You've got your happy <laughs> dance, your happy clicking dance. I don't know what it is. Listen, um, we are sorting out with some delicious, healthy recipes. This one's filled with nutrients and vitamins and texture. Yes. It's an Asian inspired kind of deal or mish of things. It is, it's a beautiful noodle dish. Um, again, it's a really, really easy weeknight meal to make. As you can see, we've got tons of our gorgeous greens again. I'm um, oh, all man, about those beautiful, it. rich greens, veggies, um, also, also fabulous. Yeah. for fighting cancer packed with antioxidants and, and which fight your free radical yeah, damage yeah, you know all of that so and once again great to be following a plant-based type of lifestyle yes, so exactly. so let's get into it amy this so, looks like a lot to get through yes yeah, so what, what you've got over here is um some tamari which is your gluten-free soy yes. sauce that's going to give it the banging flavor we've got some mirin and some sake as well these are kind of our beautiful asian flavors you can of course use something like rice wine vinegar if you can't find sake and sake does have a little bit of alcohol in it so if you want to yeah. do alcohol free go for your rice wine vinegar right. but i mean it's such a little it's amount really, that you're putting in there so what we're going to do is just put some oil in a hot pan as you can see you want the pan to be nice and hot because with stir yeah. fries it's about quick it's about cooking quick, yeah. crunchy foods and then we're going to quickly whoop we're going to quickly add our mm, sizzling garlic chili Got it. and uh Look at lovely you. ginger Look at I, that. I don't even know if i should help out at this stage because it seems to get everything under control which is good mm. but if you want to get your hands on this dish uh, or this recipe the keyword is dish <laughs> as soon as that to three three seven two eight dish to three three seven two eight yes and we'll send you Ooh. the ingredients list and a link to the recipe as well so what I'm doing now is adding some mushrooms. I think whenever you're doing like a, a plant-based meal, yeah. you want to be able to have some ingredient that gives you that almost that, that body, that, body, yeah, that, that kind of heartiness. It mushrooms it. are fabulous for that. And also mushrooms are a great plant source of vitamin D, which is again very important for a breast cancer uh, diet. Yes. And um, in fact, there is a theory that um, if you leave your mushrooms in the sun, they absorb even more vitamin D. I heard that. You can call yeah. them sunbathing your mushrooms. So we're just going to saute those very quickly. Add the rest of our greens. We've got some beautiful broccoli over here. All right, there we go with a tender stem, which I also yes, love. Yes, tender stem, just to shake things up a little bit. Some baby right. spinach. These are sugar snap peas. Oh, we just them. Yeah, sliced yeah, yeah. in a kind of cute way. Here we go. A little bit of spring onion again. I like spring onion because it's not as harsh as kind of your other onions. It's yes. a more subtle flavor. All right. And now we're going to add our lovely tamari. Woo! Yeah, <laughs> the excitement from Amy is, oh man, it's infectious this morning. Can you smell how gorgeous that is? But yes. that's what I love about Asian kind of, the flavorings are so nice. It's simple, really healthy. And you can see how quickly those spinach starts wilting. And, exactly. And, and, I mean, you, you don't want to get it to going for much bit. longer than no, this. No, not at all. We're going to put our lovely rice noodles in here now. You can obviously serve this dish just with rice, yeah. but rice noodles makes it quite fun and yes. it's a little bit different. We've got a little bit of water from the soaking liquid left, so I'm just going to add a little bit of that in as well. There okay, go. And just a bit of liquid, yeah. mix this all together. And look there at that. Go. Listen, the keyword once again is dish. SM is that to 33728. That's dish to 33728 to get your hands on uh, the ingredients as well as a link to the recipe. You can also visit uh, our website, expressoshow.com. As you can see, we've recipe. got our ready made dish over here. Yeah. Um, absolutely gorgeous. We're going to just add a little bit of coriander to this. This is our last touch. And I love coriander again. Oh, man. So good for you. It's actually a great natural detoxifier as well. And then, of course, fresh lime juice. Goes oh, in there. I mean, the flavors of divine. this, you can, you can smell it. Oh, um, it, it smells absolutely amazing. So just with regards to the noodles, you didn't cook them or anything, just some boiling just water. Just soak them in some water. Just normal water. Exactly. Uh, I would go warm or room temperature water, obviously, but warmer means they'll soak a yeah. bit faster. While, so you don't want them to be completely soft because once they come in here, they're going to soak up the beautiful tamari and other right, liquids and flavors. Right. So you just set this aside for about... Um, five or so more minutes and then everything and then we're will good be to ready. go that's the finished product it looks absolutely amazing it smells absolutely amazing the keyword once again dish to 33728 amy thank you very much for sorting absolute us out with some healthy eating this morning